What's up, everybody? Hope everyone's doing great today. I'm doing good. I'm gonna record another video here for you on commissions. We can use Excel to calculate commissions through uh, functions, which we're gonna use the, the if function. And um, let's just hop right into it. Okay, we've got this uh, table here. These are your commissions. We've got, if you make in sales over 250 grand for the year, you get 5% commission. Between 150 and 250, 3%. 75 to 150, 1%. And if you don't even make 75,000 in sales, you don't get a bonus or your commission. Now, let's say we've got these people here. Here's all the, the different salesmen that we have in the company. Here's their sales. We want to figure out commissions. So, we could mainly say, oh, Joe got 360,000, that's over 250. So it's 5% times this 361,000, but we need to let Excel do this for us. So let's, we're gonna do this through if statements. So let's start off with the first if statement. We're just gonna type it right in, if, and what's the test? First we're testing, is this greater than 250,000? We wanna start off with the highest one. Is, if it is, then we want 0 0.05 with, to represent 5%, because then we're gonna use it in the calculation. And then, what's the false value? For now, I'm just gonna put zero, just to show you how the first if statement works. Press enter. We got 0 0.05, now if we copy this down, zero, here's a 0 0.05, because it's over 250, and that's it. However, I mean, we still need to take into account this 3% and this 1%. So let's continue on with, with doing this uh, function here. So right now we've got up here, is it greater than 250? If it is, you point zero five. If it's not, here we're gonna do our nested if. We're gonna do a second if statement. And we're just kind of doing the same thing. If, we're typing it in, E5. Now we're checking this again. Cause say this wasn't greater than 250. Now we're gonna say, is it greater, is it 150 to 249? So we're gonna say, is E5 greater than 149,999. So that means if it's 150,000 or greater. I mean, it could, you, you could, I mean, 500,000 is greater than, than this 149,000. And you'd think it could show the 3%, but it's not. Because if it was 500,000, it would get picked up in this first part. That's why we have to start off with the, with the highest value first when we're looking in, in greater than. So is it greater than 149,999? If it is, then we get 0 0.03. If it's not, we'll put a zero again. Uh, they give me the error because I missed putting a, a second parentheses. See, there's supposed to be two parentheses. I gotta make sure I close out this if statement and close out the big if statement. So now if I copy this down, so now I got 0 0.05, 0 0.05, and these are 0 0.03. However, this one still, this one technically should still be 0.1%, so we need to complete our if statement here. So now instead of a zero, I'm going to delete this and we put our if statement again. If, if 5 is greater than 74999. So now we're going to pick up this. Is it greater than it? So we do 0 0.01. And if it's not, then we're just going to put a 0. Because then if it's not any, if it's not greater than any of these, then it's got to be under 75,000. And under 75,000 is no commission. So I gotta add one more parentheses to close the, this if off. So now see we got one, two, three if statements and we end up with three parentheses this way. Press enter. Now we copy this down and this is right. So we have 5%, one, five, three, and 3%. So, however, we're not done yet because we wanna actually calculate what the commission is and not just point, point zero 0.05. So all we need to do is just take this multiply it by this cell, which is E5. Press enter. So now there's a commission, $18,052.95. If we copy this down, all I'm doing is dragging this in the lower right, when you see a little plus, you can copy it down. And there we go, we've got all our commissions. And now if the sales had changed, if this 361,000 really was 232,000, the commission structure would change too, because now it's only 3% of this amount, 
and it's only 6960. So that is how we are we use Excel functions, mainly the if function, to calculate the commissions. Hope you liked it, guys. Have a great day. Thanks.